up is an easy way to show your holiday spirit. Hi, Sharks. I'm Bill. And I'm Bill. And together we're the... Bill, Bill Webster's. <laughs> As you've probably guessed, we're the father-son team behind Garage Celebrations. Sharks, today we're looking for a $200,000 investment for 20% of our business. You know, decorating for the holidays can be a real pain. You have to crawl up into your attic, find that dusty box of decorations, pull out the ratty wreaths and the plastic candy canes, and for sure you're going to find a big wad of tangled Christmas lights. There's got to be an easier way. Sharks, the outdoor holiday decorating industry is multi-billion dollar. Whether it's Christmas lights, Halloween graveyards in the front yard, or flags on the 4th of July. But most people are missing the opportunity to decorate the largest surface on their home. Introducing Garage Celebrations. Our decorative garage door covers fit on most residential garage doors, both in one car and two car sizes. Better yet, they're super easy to install and require no tools, clips, cords, or tape. And the best part is our flexible covers stretch with the opening and closing of the garage door, so it doesn't wow. impede the operation of the door. What's cool is we have covers for all the major holidays and events, everything from Christmas to Halloween to the 4th of July. Our covers are reusable, they're machine washable, and they fold for easy storage. So how about it, Sharks? Who wants to help us turn America's boring garage doors into Garage Celebrations? celebrations. <laughs> Ta-da! Ta so Sharks, in front of you, you each have one of our more popular covers. Robert, we gave you Santa for Christmas. Well, because I'm jolly. There you go. <laughs> Lori, we gave you the smiling pumpkins for Halloween. Love it. Mr. Wonderful, we gave you Frankenstein. Now, Kevin, don't yes. read into that. Don't read into that. Barbara, we gave you our dogs for uh, Christmas dog dogs. There, by the way. Exactly. I'm suing you. <laughs> and Mark, we gave you an American flag for the Fourth of July. Yes, sir. Thank you, guys. It's it's really oh, cool. Nice Have I? Is there other products out there? There, there is actually. Oh. Uh, there are vinyl covers uh, that have clips and uh, screws. Oh, I and they, do they rip and tear? They do. Oh, have you ever seen a vinyl cover that isn't creased yeah, they don't, and they shiny and look bad? Mm -hmm. Would you explain to me how it attaches to the garage door? Ah, that was ah is the trick. So the magic sauce. This is the Santa Claus oh, my robber oh, hat. Oh. There he is. The, the <laughs> fabric, it's it's 6% spandex, so it's, uh, it's like a big pair of Lululemon <laughs> yoga pants. <laughs> the important part is the connection. And at each corner of the cover, there's a cutout. Now, we call this the collar. We've gone ahead and mocked up a corner of a garage door for you. You will open your garage door a little bit just so you have access to all four corners. You'll take the collar, you'll wrap it around the corner of the garage door, and then zip up the collar well, that's smart. on all four Clever, corners. yeah. That is so yeah. easy. Even I could do it. There we go. There we go. Got it. Because the fabric stretches, it can accommodate a wide range. So we're able to fit on almost everyone's garage door. Have it look plus fantastic. or minus four or five inches. Okay, actually. but yep. Bill squared. So okay, let me ask you something. Because <laughs> well, over the years, we've seen many holiday items. Right. And the big issue with all of them is seasonality. How do you know which style, which colors, which sizes to order? Because you have to have them there just before the holidays hit. Well, we don't yet because we're <laughs> we're just starting now. Oh, oh you're pre oh. you're pre revenue. <laughs> No, no, we're not. No. They sold one to Grandma. We have one hundred and seventy-five thousand dollars in sales over That's what period good. of time? Just took delivery of the product last week and delivered. Oh my God! Oh, wow. so where did you pre-sell them? Halloween retailer in the country. They ordered sight unseen. Bill, what do you sell this for? That one car garage door cover sells for one hundred and twenty dollars, and our landed cost is thirty-five. So what are you selling it to that retailer for? But 40, what? Three. 43, 43, that's not enough. This deal, we said, well, we can't afford to really turn down that order. Well, you made and the mistake of telling it was $129 retail and they wanted half off, right? Yeah, oh, they right. wanted 70% off. Yeah. They wanted a we ton wish. off. All right, so the material's I'm, I'm coming really in right curious. now. You've just started this. Right. Yep. What made you come up with this? Is it your full-time job? I've been a serial entrepreneur, um, and a couple years ago, I retired. And so I did an add-on to the house, and I did all my honeydews for my wife, and I played a little golf. And I was depressed. I hated being retired. Uh, I want my phone to ring with something other than somebody offering to renew the warranty on my car. <laughs> and so I started looking at it saying, I gotta find something else to do. 
and I've always been playing around with this idea of these garage door covers. And so I turned to my son, who's the Harvard uh, architect graduate, and said, hey, can you help me productize this? So I had enough skill to look at it and say, okay, how do we take this beyond just putting a sign on a garage, right? How do we protect it? How do we patent the attachment? And ultimately, how do we make it easy? You know, it's not always easy working with your dad. However, our skills are fantastic together and we've done a heck of a lot. Okay, guys. Okay, come out, Kevin, come back. Why is this worth a million dollars? You haven't made a dime on it yet, including that order, which you gave away for basically your cost. So why is it worth a million dollars? Because it's not proprietary. You told me there's lots of other guys doing it. No, Bill and it Bill. is proprietary. The, the connection What's proprietary about the collar? The patent, utility patent on the collar itself. But Bill, how are you gonna generate more sales? We're gonna get social, 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 social. Show people how this works. And how who it has that specialty? It, who knows is, how your, to do is your dad big on Instagram? <laughs> no, not yet. Not, not yet, <laughs> but he's gonna be. <laughs> Who did your designs? Oh. He did. <laughs> I want to start with the design, if I might, and please don't be offended, all right? All sharks are in, and Barbara has a critique on the design of Bill and Bill's garage decoration product, Garage Celebrations. Please don't be offended, but my first impression of this product is it looks dated. It's the design elements that don't look fresh. The letter style doesn't look right to me. It just the whole thing looks dated and not that attractive. Mm -hmm. I just don't see this going anywhere, honestly. So for that reason, I'm out. <laughs> but don't be offended. Well, don't be, we're not. It, we won't. We're uh, lucky to be I here. I guess I have a little bit of a different spin on it. I love this one. Halloween happens yeah. to be like my favorite holiday. This, I think, looks beautiful. To Barbara's point, some of the others you could change, but that's an easy fix. I think this is perfectly doable and a nice business for you guys. But for me, I don't think it's the right kind of investment. I'm oh, sorry to hear that. I'm uh, Thanks for thanks. the feedback. What are you gonna do with the money? There's, there's a couple things. One is, there's, we're, these are being made in Vietnam right now. It's taking like five months from order to landed. Right, your, your challenge though, guys, look, the real money is going to come from customized versions, right. right? So how does that work if you've got a five month lead time? Well, it doesn't actually. One, personalized covers can command a little more money. Yeah. And secondly- It's also our, gonna take a lot more work. Do you have any software developed that lets people upload their high-res JPEG? Right, that's where we're going. So tell me about that, because that's, that's the around. real chance for the company. Yes, we can actually start to do it now. Yes. Um, our, our manufacturer in, in Vietnam is ready to take, we, we basically just emailed them the, the graphic. He right. makes it. So I, I don't agree with the customization. I look at the two of you, I love you guys, but how do I invest 200,000 for 20% and then what? We go out and hire somebody to be the brains of the social media rollout? We would like some help getting us, you know, we've got everything underway. All right, guys, look, there's a person missing here that's gonna do that for you because in reality, what's happened is the cost of customer acquisition has gone up in some cases 80%. And so strategies now have moved to more of a community structure so that you build word of mouth on platforms like TikTok. Right. And you have to be very sophisticated to do it because this product would sell well in 59 seconds on TikTok if you knew how to do it. Look, I love it, but I don't see an opportunity to make a lot of money here, so I'm sorry, guys, I'm out. Bill, Thanks, Bill, Kevin. I Appreciate it. love the product, love you guys, but there's something really big missing in this deal, and that's a third bill. Somebody that understands e-commerce and socially driven marketing and all that kind right. of stuff. I'm not saying you can't learn it, yeah. but from where you are today to get to that path, it's gonna be a long road. I wish you were farther along, but because the third bill isn't here, I can't be in. I'm out, I'm I, sorry. I appreciate it. So guys, that leads me to a question. So you order the materials the fabric, the fabric. and then you send it to them in Vietnam. Mm -hmm. yep. And what kind of machine do they use to cut it and print it? They're using a six foot dye sublimation printer. We wanna, we wanna buy our own machine. And that what would does make the machine cheap. cost? If that, we bought our own that, machine. The machine costs about $60,000, $80,000. That's all? Yeah. That's so we could buy a machine, that'd be why an option. Choice. So Why don't you get this straight then? You guys could take this money, yeah. buy a machine, Yep. 
do it all in your garage. Oh, then, then you yeah. can build to order. Yeah. I just like it because I can make some for the Mavs, and I just like if the price Why is low enough. Why don't you buy them instead? What's that? Why don't you <laughs> buy the banners instead? Yeah, but I, these guys are fun, and they can do most of the work. Yeah, exactly. Right? Yeah, they're I don't here to do, do the work. Got a lot you of guys. So I'll, I'll make you an offer. Um, sure. I'll give you the 200 k I want 30% of the company. 30%. Don't just say yes. What did you think was going to happen in Shark Tank? Well, they, 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 they keep it entertaining. Sharky you offer. Right. That's not Sharky. Uh, Mark, you got a deal. Done. Good job. I just think it's going to be fun. Thanks, man. Appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. Good to meet you. Yeah. Dad, <laughs> enjoy Thanks a lot. Thanks, Thanks man. Man. Yeah, appreciate Thank it. Thank you all, everyone. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. 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 All right. All right. Oh, Mark, you're the third bill. Yeah. <laughs> you just like them, basically, right? Yeah, I like these guys. It'll be fun for my kids. It'll be fun for the community. It'll be fun like, for the mass. Let's not even call it Shark Tank anymore. Let's call it the Fun Tank. Yeah, well, that's where you can make a lot of money sometimes, doing a business that you have fun with.